Hi guys, I'm gonna do my autumn look. Sorry, I did have footage for this, but it got deleted for some reason and it drove me nuts. So basically, I'm just gonna start with the eyes first. So I'm just gonna take a brush, um, basically just gonna dry it because it's got like, dark stuff on it. And I'm gonna put a lighter brown on. I'm gonna put a light shade all over my eyes. So basically, I'm gonna start with this color. This color right here, just to give it all over my eyes so it's a contrasting. So it's um something that I can do with my eyes. So guys, that colour right there is all that colour. That colour right there is all the lid. So now I'm gonna take a a lighty darky, a medium to dark brown, and just gonna put that into my crease. So you can see that it's into my crease now and it I like it. You just have to blend it out so it blends all together. So there we go. So that is just blended out now. So it's this colour that I'm it's this colour that I'm using. It's just like a medium to browny colour. I just really like it. So you guys, so I've got that shade and this is from the um I love makeup you're gorgeous this is from the you're gorgeous palette then i'm going to take another one because i'm going to transfer over to the makeup geek make makeup geek and it's from i love makeup and i absolutely love this palette it's so nice it's got all different shades and i absolutely love it look at that palette it looks beautiful i absolutely love the palette so i'm going to take this bronzy color down here this bronzy color down here and just put that all over my lid you can wipe your brush if you want i kind of don't need to just because on its own this color is very pigment pigmented and i like it because the the flat the leaves on the trees they change to a autumnium color as guys as you can see i've done the other eye now so i'm gonna take another shade and basically i love this shade it's a, like a gold it's a gold shade but it's like got that bronzy effect in it so i'm going to take this color this deep orangey bronzy goldy one and going to put it in onto all over the lid just lightly dusting it all over the lid which kind of is like the representation of leaves if you see leaves change they go from all to me to a gold to a bronzy to a finally a light yellow so I can see I've just done that all over the light eye, not too rough because basically I'm going to put another colour on there to basically get that yellowy stuff. So I'm going to take this colour now, this goldy shimmery colour. I love shimmer so much, it's so good. I'm just going to sweep that into the, in the corner. So I can see all the colours are packed on top, which I really like this look. It brings out the bronzy, the the bronze the brown the gold like leaves do like i love the way leaves change so what i'm going to do is going to put a darker shade in the corner so basically it will just be like just really nice and everything and just pulls the look together so nicely so i'm going to take a dark color now i don't mind too dark it's just a, a dark color that i like so i'm going to take this dark color this brown dark color and put that in the end the inner into the outer V. So guys what I'm going to do now is take a light brown just to go underneath the eye. Not too shimmery, just a lightish brown. So you can see I've put it onto the eye. So now I need some eyeliner. The eyeliner I do use is a brown eyeliner just because I like the look of brown against this color, these colours. They look so nice together and they mesh well together. I don't do a lot of blending because I want the colours to really pop. But as you can see, I've got like a, a kind of flick to both eyes. I can't do my eyeliner very well. I'm, I'm still learning to do my eyeliner, the flicks especially. So now I'm going to curl my eyelashes and put... I'm uh, um, going to curl my eyelashes with this. This is just going to traction and curl these babies. Some people have brilliant eyelashes and they don't need to really curl, they really don't. But I am a kind of a perfectionist when I want really curled eyelashes. My eyelashes are not that short, they're kind of medium to um, medium to short. But I have to basically curl 
my eyelashes just because I want the, my eyelashes to really kind of be curled and really stand out. So the mascara I am, so basically the mascara I'm using, this is a holy grail mascara of mine. It is the Last Sensation from Maybelline. I absolutely love this mascara. It's a lash multiplier mascara. It makes your lashes look look so much nicer. So I guess now I need to do my brows. And the brows I do use, I've been using this for years. It's a Rimmel uh, brow. It needs to be sharpened, but I don't mind if it's a bit dull for at the moment. Just because I don't have a sharpener on me. Basically, I need some uh, bronzer on, and the bronzer that I do put on all over my face is this bronzer. I'm going to contour for us first, first though, and I use the Masterscope contour. I always contour with this just because I love the way it kind of um, feels and everything. I just love the way it kind of stands. Sorry, I'm making too much noise. I'm just trying to get my mirrors to be bigger. So I basically um, do contour. I do contour, and this is the Master Sculpt one. I do like this one. It is in the make shade medium to dark, which I don't mind. It's good if you have dark skin, but or medium skin. I have very light skin, so I need to get the light one. You can see I drew a line like that, and then I'm just blending it in, really. There we go. I do suck in my cheeks as well when I do this all the time. Using the lash highlights at the top, it will get covered with blush, but at the moment I'm going to contour. So I normally contour my forehead, my neck, and my chin, and then I do my nose. I don't kind of, I do contour my nose very rarely. I contour my nose all the time. Not very rarely. All the time. But I love this bronzer. It's just so nice to have um, a little bit of bronzer skin and everything. Because I know what we've us guys like we're like oh my god we need to have a bit more bronze to our skin so i have just got my forehead with this bronzer and i just like it it's soft it's nice it's it's bronzy and i just love it i'm gonna use the blush and the blush i do use is this soft blush i always have this blush i need to get some more blushes i put the brush on my cheeks and it's gonna blend so well with this contour So for my lips, I do use a like a very sort of um, plummy shade. The shade that I've got right here, I love this colour. It's so nice and vibrant and it's so deep. It's, it is a little bit light, but you've got that deepness there as well. It's called Amethyst Shimmer and the colour is so beautiful. I love this colour. Ooh, I, mean, I love this colour so much. It doesn't match my nails, I know. But I love this colour so much. It is light, but it does go on and it does kind of darken up through when you do have it on. So I'm going to put this on. So this is the completed autumn look. I'm just going to take my hair out now, just to basically take my hair out. So this is a completed autumn look. I hope you like it. My other one got deleted. I'm so sorry. So I had to do this one again. Um, it's just a natural autumn look that I absolutely love. I will constantly wear this because it's just one of the ones that I love. And as you can see with the eyes, I didn't like a tree. So at the bottom, there's dark. And then you, there's brown at the bottom of the eyeliner. And then basically the eyeliner is the stalk as well. So then you've got the tree bit. Then the leaves bit are right at the top. The dark bit on the top is just to contour my crease that's all and um, you can do it as like the tops of the leaves are a little bit brown or anything like that but I just love this look um so give this a big thumbs up if you like this uh, tutorial of this makeup routine um, I will be doing a foundation routine I am doing vlogs daily so please look out for that the, the vlogs will be down below and everything that I use will be down below just in case if you're wondering what I did use so guys I love you guys so much and have a fantastic day bye guys Mwah.